Hello everyone, Neon Jigglypuff here, and welcome back to another episode of Not Thousand Year Door of the Super Smash Brothers series. Yeah, I'm continuing it on again because I realized I didn't do a lot with Brawl. I mean, yeah, I, I, I did a lot with Brawl. I did the uh, All-Star mode, I did Classic mode, and I did Story mode, but I didn't do Event mode. I realized that. I didn't do Event mode at all, and since Ultimate's coming out in the next five months or so, yeah, it's about uh, five months, I figured Let's continue on the Smash Brothers series to get that hype going. So, um, yeah, I'm going to be doing event mode for Brawl, and then later on I'll be doing event mode for Smash 4. So, really, the Smash Brothers series, I'm glad to announce, is not over yet. It's going to continue on all the way to Ultimate, and then I'll do everything in Ultimate, being unlocking every character, doing the classic mode, event mode, all-star. If there's a story mode, I'll do that for sure. I might do that, actually, like, uh, first. And then a little secret going on, even though it's not really a secret, I've announced it a long time ago, but you know, I want you guys to watch the video. So, I did all of the events, I guess, I don't remember doing them, but I had this since I was a little kid, so I guess I did all on easy mode. I'm going to do it on easy mode too, because I'm not trying to sit here all day and be like, oh, oh, so hard, pause, right? So, I'm going to do all events, it's like, what? How many events are there? 41. Okay, so it's not 51, it's 41 now. So, um, yeah, let's get raw into the news. That was not funny. Anyway, okay, I'm going to go on easy. I know, easy mode, boys, but I'm not trying to sit here all day and do it all over and over and over again, right? Two greedy kings. I believe there's a, there's a player two option in this. So, like, if there was a player two, someone else would be playing as Kirby, I believe. And, oh, God. I forgot how lengthy the loading screens were in Brawl, so um, if the loading screens take a bit too long, then I might end up just skipping ahead until they're done loading. And you know what? I'll try and get Orlando to help me on the series too. Not series, but I mean the um, the events, because I know there's their two player, and if he were playing, it would have been Kirby as player two. That's why uh, DDD and Bowser are here, but no problem. They're gonna be dead anyway. Oh my god, Brawl's so weird, so floaty. But anyway, there we go. Bowser's gone. And it's successful! Okay, event two, let's see. Um, Landmaster. Okay, Landmaster Ignition. Slippy, send me a Landmaster. Show Star Fox. Oh! Show them Star Fox's final smash. Okay, simple. Just get the final smash and that's it. So, um, anyway, while I'm playing Smash Brothers Brawl. Let's talk about Ultimate and, oh my god, lengthy loading screens. This is great. But anyway... Oh wait! Wait, what? I have to kill them with the Landmaster, don't I? Well, wait, hold on. What? Is that it? What? What? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, what? Okay, I'm confused. I'm really, really confused. Wait, what am I supposed? Wait. What the hell is this? Um, what? Uh, guys? Wait, what? That's it? Okay. Anyway, let's talk about Smash Bros. Ultimate. Wait, what is it? Kirby Mutt? That's not bored the halberd. Okay. Um... Yeah, Smash Ultimate. I'm excited that every character's pretty- I finally- Okay, at long last. I'm talking about it again, but Smash Bros. Ultimate. I am so excited because- Wait, what the- No. Get out of here! Okay, I, I keep getting distracted. I can't fight and talk at the same time. This is casual. It's not. Well, that was easy. Smash Ultimate. I am so excited because every character is returning. Wolf is back. Ice Climbers are back. Snake's back. I didn't expect Snake to ever come back. Like there are characters that I would, I thought that would never come back for a reason or another. Like Squirtle and Ivysaur. I love Ivysaur, but they felt kind of tacked on. And whoa, I thought that was Wario for a second. They felt kind of tacked on to a Charizard and Brawl, but in this game, from what I've seen, they feel like they belong in the moveset now, and it's great. Wolf, he looks like like his animations and 
and moveset have been touched up, so he's not rushed in this game, because like in this game, his animations were really jerky and like weird. And I didn't really like that, because he was rushed. See, because like if I were to like to um to uh, show you gameplay of Wolf right now, you would notice his lack of polish. Like every character has polish except for him. He looks very weird. But in in ultimate it seems like that's all, like, it, it's all uh, fixed up now, and that's great. It's fixed up, he's back to normal, and yeah, I love it. Ice Climbers are still- what? What? Are we supposed to break all the- Is that what we're supposed to do? Break everything? I assume, because I killed Wario and he's still going on. Um, okay, let's break all the platforms, I guess. I- the timer isn't... Oh, uh, what? Oh, my phone just went off. Ooh, I should probably mute that. Actually, no, it's on vibrate, I forgot. Oh, I was literally supposed to do that, and that's it. Okay, let's see what we do. Become the champion, Pokemon tournament. Oh, okay, put my best Pokemon up to match. Okay, good. We're gonna play as Ivysaur now. I cannot wait to play as Ivysaur. Like, there's so much stuff. Oh, I'm already playing as Diamond Star, cool. But yeah, like, Smash Ultimate looks so freaking good. Wait a minute, oh, I can't switch out. I, I can't use the crappy um, mechanic to my advantage where, like, Ivy sort of screwed over by all fire attacks, and that's so dumb. I really hate that, but it's gone. There's no penalty. Your Pokemon do not get tired anymore. It's great. And, um, yeah, I love it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is Ivysaur doing to that Charizard? Ew! Look at Charizard's face! That's disgusting. Charizard looks so bad in this game. I don't know what. Look at his run, too. Oh, wait, I'm at a, a disadvantage now. Oh, crap. Goodbye. Okay, Squirtle. I believe that's a shiny Squirtle, or does shiny Squirtle have a green gel? I'm not sure, but I know the Ivysaur is shiny, but not the Squirtle. Wait, ooh, okay. So this is pretty cool. So I'm glad to be uh, back in, in the Smash Bros. series, because it's been pretty, uh, it's, it's been a long time. So I've done it! I did it. It's been a long time, and um, it's good to be back, because I really miss playing Super Smash Bros. See what it's like to be Mario, survive as you race to the flag as Bowser. Okay, so um, Smash Ultimate. That's so much I want to talk about. Snake's logo, it changed. It's not his organization logo, I assume it was, because my friend told me. I've never played, um, I almost said Fire Emblem. I've never played um, Metal Gear before, but I know that his logo was actually like his organization logo, but now it's changed to the more appropriate um, exclamation point. Okay, Mario's, can you stop, please? I just want to be Mario. I want to. Wait, his jump is different. He has the traditional Mario jump. Look at that. Wow. Wait a minute. Whoa, whoa. Hold on. Oh, there's a lot of spikes. Is that... No. What? Okay. As I was saying, Bowser has a lot of spikes in this game, but I realize that it's the same amount. It's just that his shell is a bit longer and bigger in this game for some reason. Did I win? I won! Did I? I, what? Oh, okay. I won the game. Cool. I keep saying Smash Ultimate, Smash Ultimate. I, I, I get distracted. Every single character is here, but let's focus on the newcomers, okay? I thought I muted my phone. Okay. But anyway, my dream character is finally added to Super Smash Brothers after all these years. I've wanted him since Brawl. Everyone else wanted him since Melee. I'm talking about... The man of the hour, Ridley. Everyone was saying, everyone told me, literally all my friends or random people on the internet would always get into heated arguments saying I was wrong because Ridley's too big for Smash. Yeah, 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 oh, he's too big. Sakurai said something a few years ago, even though he constantly contradicts himself all the time, like with Fire Emblem characters and, um, and, uh, let's see. What is it? Pointing too many uh, Mario characters in Smash Brothers in, in Melee. Saying the original um, roster is never gonna get cut, yet in Melee he, he almost cut Nest, and in Brawl he almost cut Jigglypuff. Um, he, oh, 
third-party reps being like, oh, we're only gonna have a few third-party reps in Smash 4, but then we ended up getting six of them in total. Um, yeah, he's contradicted himself a lot. So the fact that he said Ridley will never be in Smash Brothers, I wasn't gonna believe that. I'm not taking no for an answer. I kept supporting Ridley even after Smash 4 deconfirmed him as a freaking um, stage boss. I was still a Ridley supporter. I voted him every day in the Smash ballot. Didn't work because as we found out recently, the Smash ballot was rigged. Bayonetta did not win. She was chosen way, way early on. The Smash ballot was actually for Smash Ultimate. So I mean, they knew uh, like a sequel was actually on the way way back in 2015 like early 2015 they knew they're gonna make a sequel so that's pretty crazy which means you know they probably said like you know Ridley he's voted really highly on the smash ballot we got I gotta make it work that's what Sakurai said I gotta make it work I know Ridley I tried in the fact because like he tried to make um like a uh, Ridley a character in Brawl and in Smash 4. He attempted to, but he didn't like how he turned out, so he left him out. But he really did try. You know what? I respect him for trying at the very least, but this time he actually did it. Not only did he. Is that it? Wow. And I'm gonna mute my notifications because my phone keeps going off and that's gonna be. Alright, I'm back. I had to mute some notifications on my phone. And reply to a message I got because it was kind of important, but that's not important right now. It's kind of important, not important right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But let's talk about Smash Bros. Ultimate. Okay, Ridley. I know Sakurai contradicts himself all the time, saying certain characters won't be in or this and that. He contradicts himself, but then he does it anyway. So like, you know, I was a Ridley supporter all the time, and I'm just so glad he's back. I'm not. I'm, I'm glad everyone's back. Like Ice Climbers, I missed you. Ivysaur, Squirtle, missed you. Snake was not expecting that. Pichu and Young Link, again, I thought that, like, like, ugh, sorry, I burped right there. It, uh, like, if Pichu and Young Link, I thought they would never come back because they're, I thought they were pointless. A character who hurts himself is dumb, and we have Toon Link. Uh, but nope, they're back, and you know what? I couldn't be happier. And Amiibo, oh my god, I'm gonna have to buy all those Amiibo. But anyway, what character should I be? See, I would be Jigglypuff, but should I carry on the bias or should I pick a different character you know I, I guess being Jigglypuff wouldn't hurt one time there's no crown alt so I guess I can be shiny or hat I guess I'll be the sleepy hat yeah I'll be sleepy hat Jigglypuff you know because it's bias I'm I'm neon Jigglypuff I gotta be my main and bro actually fun fact um I hate to admit it but Jigglypuff actually isn't my main in Brawl. I think I said that in the past, but I, I was, you know what, admittedly, I was lying to myself. Jigglypuff's not my main in Brawl because, well, I'm still decent with Jigglypuff. I just don't like how they nerfed her to the point where she's, like, terrible. And the, the, like, the engine doesn't clash with her that well at all. I don't know. I don't really like Jigglypuff in this game. I mean, I like Jigglypuff, but I don't like how... Okay! Okay then! Sure, just kill me, why don't you? Um, yeah, Jigg so Jigglypuff isn't actually my main in Brawl. I hate to admit it, but she isn't. I play her, but she isn't my main, nor is she my secondary. I would refer to her as a pocket. Smash 4 in Melee? Yeah, I main her. But in Brawl? No, I'd say she's a pocket or like an extra substitute. My main in Brawl is actually Pit. I main Pit in Brawl, and my secondary, I would say, is Mario or Wolf. It's one of those two. Mario or Wolf, but it's not Jigglypuff, unfortunately not. But only because I don't like the engine and how she got nerfed. Sure, in Smash 4, she got no buffs at all, like she's literally the same, but the engine made her a bit better because the engine's slightly faster. But still, you know, I don't like that. So I'm hoping in Smash Ultimate, she gets buffed. She looks a bit faster, but I don't know that for sure. I can only tell when the game comes out. So we won't know. I won't know until the game comes out eventually. So yeah, are you kidding me? See, I would have used Rest, but Rest doesn't do anything in this game. Rest kills at like 70% in this game. As we're in Melee, it killed at 
And rest kills that freaking... Like... Ugh. One more try. I'll try one more time. But you know what? Instead of Puff... I'm gonna go random. Wait, can I change my username, actually? Uh... Oh, my old username. 644. Ooh. Okay. Blast of the past. New entry. Let's put my old name in there. Or my new name in this. Are you serious? What? Okay, it wouldn't let me put Neon, but I have Neon. Whatever. Okay, let's get on to this. Luigi. Interesting choice. Okay, I can kind of... I can do this. I can play Mario in this game. I can kind of play Luigi as well. Fun fact. Way, 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 way back in the day, when I was like a little kid, before I, I played competitively, right? My favorite character in Smash Bros. Oh, while it was Jigglypuff, I also really, really liked Luigi. Like, I was obsessed with Luigi, and I have no idea why. And it was only a Smash Bros. thing. In every other game, I didn't really care about Luigi. It was just Smash Brothers. I thought that was me, and I was like, getting really mad, but it's not me, so I'm good. Thanks, Shadow. Shadow! Wow, Shadow helping Luigi. That's kind of weird. I don't know why it is, but it's weird. Oh, goodbye, Link. Are you serious? Hey, look at this. Luigi had a gun before Mario Plus Rabbit's Kingdom Battle. Look at that. Let's kill Samus. I'm sorry, Samus. I really like Metroid, but, um... Yeah, you're gonna have to die. What was that? Anyway, um... So, while we're on the topic of Smash Bros. Ultimate, new characters so far are... Wrigley, Daisy, and... I almost said Waluigi. I wish Waluigi. But don't give me... Waluigi's a story on its own. Don't get me started on... It's not really him, but it's... It's just, uh... I don't know. The topic of Waluigi is just... I'll get that in a later episode, but, um... Anyway. Uh, new characters. Ridley, Daisy, and Inkling. That's gonna be really freaking cool, because Inkling deserves to be in Smash Brothers. Ridley deserves... Like, he's my dream character, obviously. I'm biased to Ridley. And Daisy, well, she doesn't deserve to be in Smash Brothers. I understand why she is, because she's an Echo. She was, like, easy to implement and took, like, a very few man hours. So, uh, while I don't like Daisy, I am not gonna say she's a waste of a character slot. She's a waste. She's a waste like everybody else does. Like, I don't mind clone characters. In fact, I actually like clone characters because they expand the roster and they add more variety despite them being literally the same character. They add more variety for mains of Peach. Now they have two different versions of Peach. Same with Marth mains and Pit mains. Like, myself. I don't main Pit, but you know what I mean. Um, wait. Kill them in order. Oh, no! Wait, wait. Oh, crap. Red, pink, yellow. Ooh. I didn't get to see that. Wait. I'll reset. I didn't get to see that. So, I, I don't mind clone characters. In fact, I want a few more. Oh! Let me get on a different top. I'm gonna rant a little bit. Here, okay. It's time for a nerd rant. Hold on. Let me just read what colors I... Actually, you know what? I'll, I'll save the rant for a bit later when I don't have to focus. Okay. Red, pink, yellow, green, pale, blue, blue. Red, pink, yellow, green. Okay, so it's in like a rainbow order. Okay, I can remember that. Rainbow order. So, on this topic, let's talk about Ice Climbers now, since we're playing as them for some reason. Ice Climbers, they got nerfed. In a good way. Because Ice Climbers were always broken by either chain grabbing or wobbling. Chain grabbing and wobbling is no longer a thing, because when Popo grabs someone, I can't grab them again. See that? I can't do that in Ultimate because... Oh, God! Okay. Because in Ultimate, when Popo or Nana, whoever's in front, um, grabs them, the other Ice Climber will cheer for you, which meaning that they can't grab you immediately after. So there's no wobbling, no chain grabbing. So Ice Climbers have been nerfed in that sense to the point where they're not completely broken anymore. Ice Climbers have been nerfed, but it's a nerf that needed to happen. They're still really good characters. Ready? It's just that they got nerfed and it it kind of had to happen, you know what I mean? Cause like, I'm glad they're back, but I didn't like chain grabbing or wobbling. Not one bit, hated it. But I'm glad they're nerfed because it's a nerf that needs to be happened. Now it's time for Bayonetta to get nerfed, please. I don't know how they're gonna nerf her exactly because she's a combo based character and they can't just get rid of her combos because it's not, that's not her character. That's just not who she is, it's not right. So um, yeah, they should just nerf Bayonetta somehow. I don't know how they're going to do it, but nerf Bayonetta and um, make her not super good anymore because that's really dumb. Didn't like it. Okay, what is happening? 
Yoshi's Final Smash. Okay, I never understood this Final Smash. I know it's a like it's a Mario World thing where like he spits the fire from the red shells and he flies in the blue shells, but I never really understood this Final Smash. I'm not saying I hate it, I just don't understand it that well. But um, in Smash Ultimate, since there's no more controlling or transforming Final Smashes, I wonder what his new one's gonna be now. Is it gonna be the dragon again, just automatic? Or is it gonna be like something, something new? Um, whatever it is, I'm excited for it. I'm excited for a lot of new Final Smashes because like the game looks so good. The graphics are so nice. It's just, I, I got hit. This is not gonna end, is it? This isn't gonna end. This is not gonna, okay. It's not gonna end. Wait, wait, what? Do I have to kill them now? Wait, do I have to kill the... Do I have to kill the... What? Um, guys? Wait. What the hell's happening? What do I do? Wait, guys, I'm really confused right now. You know what? I'm just gonna leave the things. I don't know what to do there. I should really be reading the events, but I haven't been reading. So you can't just settle down. They might... Oh. Oh. That's all I had to do. Okay, reunite three parts of the dragon and aim them. What? Launch the enemies? Okay, so we're playing as Kirby. I'm assuming we have to kill three Wario's with the dragon. Okay then. Now let's get on a rant. This is a rant because this has been bothering me for a long time, and people like I'm not gonna roast everyone. Like roast oh, I'm, oh, I'm so perfect and all. Oh, I look down at all of you. Like no, I'm not gonna be like that. But um. There's just something that's bothered me for a long time about the Smash Bros. community. Like, this is what I don't get about the Smash Bros. community, okay? Because in Smash 4, right, with uh, Dr. Mario, Lucina, and Dark Pit, right? What I don't understand about the community, right? They say they hate clones. They don't want them anywhere near them because they're a waste of a character slot, even though they're really not. Because it was it's either clones or nothing. They're extras. But, um, yeah. People hate clone characters in Smash 4. Cut Dr. Mario, cut Lucina, cut Dark Pit, right? But as soon as Smash Ultimate happens, right? And they go by a new name, being Echo Fighters? All of a sudden, nobody hates Dark Pit anymore. Nobody hates Lucina or Dr. Mario anymore. Everybody loves Pichu and Young Link. And everyone loves Daisy. And you know what else? People want more. They want more Echo Fighters. So, really, once when they're called clones, they're cool. But when they're called Echo, no wait, when they're called clones, they're wastes of character slots, and everyone hates them. But if you change their name from clone to Echo, all of a sudden everyone accepts them now. Why? Smash Four happened. Cut Doctor Mario. Cut Lucina. Cut Dark Pit. Cut Toon Link too. For all we know, you know what I mean. Now, with the introduction of Echo Fighters, introduction I mean, um, everyone's saying Dry Bowser, Louie, Shadow, Ken, John, Ms. Pac-Man, Classic Sonic, oh ho ho, Crom for Ike, Black Shadow for Captain Falcon, oh yeah, let's, let's do more, Dr. Luigi, I've heard people say Dr. Luigi, I sh- I- you not. People said Dr. Luigi. After wanting Dr. Mario cut, they're saying Dr. Luigi and Galactic Knight and stuff like that and Dark Samus. Like, are you serious? That's what it takes. That's all it takes to change the minds of Smash Bros. This is why I, the Smash community, well, not all of them are that bad. Uh, I've met a lot of people in the Smash community that's, that are really cool people, but it just bugs the hell out of me that you can just change one, like, I don't know. It's stupid. It's so stupid. But here's another rant now. I'm sorry for that rant. I, I know it's stupid, but one more rant for an episode. Waluigi. Let's get down to Waluigi's situation, okay? Brawl in Smash 4. Everyone wanted Waluigi as a playable character. Everybody did. What the hell just happened? Everybody wanted Waluigi as a playable character. 
And, um, yeah. Didn't happen in Brawl. Assist trophy. Sucks, but oh well. Okay. So, let's talk about Smash 4 now. Smash 4 is here! Great! They might add Waluigi as a playable character now. Waluigi deconfirmed. Didn't happen. Okay, that sucks. No Waluigi in Smash 4. But everyone, the thing is, it wasn't as like casual as like, say, Brawl, like, okay, no Waluigi, that sucks, oh well. No, Smash 4, everyone was sad, like, oh, there's no Waluigi in Smash 4, but he, it was supposed to be his time. Oh man, it was supposed to be his time, right? Smash Ultimate. When there's, okay, now, when Smash Ultimate was announced, everyone, I saw so many bingo cards of newcomers, requests, fake rosters, or mock-ups, I mean. Waluigi was on almost all of them. He was on mine, right? But I'm not important here, it's other people, right? Waluigi was one of the most highly re requested characters, like Ridley, like he was Ridley, he was like Ridley at one point, right? But the thing is, right? As soon as he gets deconfirmed as an assist trophy, right? Or like he's uh, deconfirmed, he's not playable, he's still an assist trophy, right? Out of nowhere, Everyone starts hating Waluigi now, and everyone's giving stupid reasons as to why he can't be in Smash Brothers now, okay? And like, I've asked this question on Facebook, on a Smash Brothers group, right? I asked the question, I didn't say Waluigi will be in Smash Brothers, I literally asked, why is Waluigi getting a bunch of hate all of a sudden like Ridley did in Smash 4 when he was deconfirmed, right? You know what happened? I literally got called a dumbass, saying, Waluigi is an assist trophy, you dumbass, you should seriously kill yourself. Even though I was asking a question why he's getting hate. You see? And when I had to spell it out for them saying, no, I'm asking a question. I'm not saying he's going to be in Smash. I'm saying, I'm, I'm, I'm asking a question, right? They all said the same thing. While Luigi's not important, he can't be in Smash Brothers. He has nothing to call his own. He's not important. His moveset would be completely BS. What the hell happened to Waluigi's fan base? He doesn't have one, I swear, he doesn't have one anymore. It's so stupid. People could go from loving Waluigi and then one thing happens and then everyone hates him. And you know why, right? It's because people are harassing Sakurai on Smash Brothers with memes, or like on, on Twitter with Waluigi memes, right? But here's the thing. Everyone seems to think that like half the world was harassing Sakurai on Twitter when it was probably like three people or like a bunch of alt accounts with by the same guy, right? Um, I'm not saying harassing Sakurai is good or justified, it's not justified, it's it's actually horrible. Because this guy has put years on it, like, he, this guy has given us years out of his own life to give us these Smash Bros. games to make his fans happy, even though he said before that he wanted, like, he, did, he, he just doesn't want to do Smash Brothers. He doesn't want to do Smash Brothers. Melee was supposed to be the last one, Brawl was supposed to be the last one, Smash 4 was going to be the last one, now we're on Ultimate. And I appreciate the hell that, like, he's shaved years off of his life. Or, like, he's, give, he's given us years of his life to make his fans happy. And I appreciate that to the bottom of my heart. Honest to God, I appreciate that. And when people harass him because one character didn't make it in, that's disgusting of you and, honestly, you should just stop, right? But... When people use that as an excuse to hate Waluigi as a character, it's just, it's ridiculous. Like, why do you, what? Honestly, the Waluigi haters are becoming as bad as the quote-unquote toxic Waluigi fanboys. Like, they're just as bad as each other, honestly. Like, memes aside, both sides of the Waluigi fanbase, being the haters or the toxic fanboys, quote-unquote, it's annoying. It's Waluigi's literally the new Ridley. Remember, Ridley's too big thing was turned into a meme, but then started like an actual flame war. Th that's what Waluigi's hap like. That's what's happening to Waluigi. And to that, I say, if you're a quote-unquote toxic Waluigi fanboy, or if you're a toxic Waluigi hater, please stop. Just please stop. Okay. If someone wants Waluigi in Smash Brothers, leave him alone. Don't attack them. If somebody hates Waluigi, though, don't attack them either, okay? But if you if you hate Waluigi, don't go out and say, Oh, he'll never be in Smash Bros. He has, he's not important. He has never anything to call his own. Because you know what? You, you don't decide who makes it in or not. He's not in. He won't be in. But you don't decide that. 
And you shouldn't tell people they, they're they wrong for wanting a certain character in. That's it. And, um, yeah. With that all said, I know, it's a really weird way to end an episode. But, um, yeah, I'm sorry for all the negativity in this episode. Oh my god, but I'm sorry. Okay, next episode I guarantee you is not going to be as negative. It's going to be pretty cool. And, um, yeah. <laughs> if you guys enjoyed the episode and ranting episode of Smash Bros. Ultimate, Ultimate Brawl, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, favorite, and comment. And I know exactly what comment of the day I want you to do. Um, it's not going to be anything negative. Don't worry. It's not going to be Waluigi based. Here is the question, for, my question for you. Out of any character, it doesn't matter who it is, any video game character, any company, even if it's something dumb like Shrek or Spongebob, if... Or even anime characters. If who is your number one dream character out of anything, anyone to be in Smash Brothers? It could even be something obscure like, um, I don't even know, but it, it could be something obscure like Retsuko from Agrasu Agritsuko. I still don't know how to pronounce that correctly. Or Ton even. If it's any character at all, video game, anime, cartoon, movie doesn't matter. Celebrities even, as a joke. Who's your number one dream character in Smash Brothers? If I could have any character at all, like dream character, like I have Ridley, but if I could choose literally anyone, I would probably, and I would probably choose Incineroar, because I really like Incineroar, or Typhlosion, and um, Waluigi, of course. And you know what? Count Black as well, because I really like Count Black, or Dementio. But, um, yeah, what are your dream characters from anything at all? Doesn't matter. Don't be afraid to tell me. I won't judge. It could literally be something... It could be It could be James Bond. Or Austin Powers, for all I care. I really want to know, who's your dream character? Even if you're not a Smash fan, who's your dream character? Um, and with that all said, I hope you all have a great day. And I will see you guys in the next episode, which I guarantee will be more positive. Because <laughs> I had to get that rant out, and yeah... Anyway, I'll see you later, guys. I appreciate the hell out of all of you, and I will see you in the next episode. And don't forget to have a great day.